today I'll be talking about the difference between using a needle or using a cannula for dermal fillers. Traditionally, fillers have been injected with needles. It's quite a simple process. The needle pierces through the skin and into the subcutaneous tissue and the filler is then injected into the, into the tissue. Using cannulas is a new method of injecting dermal fillers which has quite a lot of advantages. Cannulas, unlike needles, have a round end on their tip. So they can't actually pierce the skin. So you actually have to make a little hole with the needle just to get through the surface of the skin. But thereafter, the round tip actually helps to push any important structures away. So you actually get less bruising and less swelling. A needle doesn't discern what it's going through. It'll pierce through anything in the skin or in the, in the subcutaneous tissue. Whereas a cannula, the operator can actually feel each structure as you pass through it. So if you come across some resistance, we don't tend to push through it. We try to find an alternative pathway. And the advantage of this is we can find a very sort of clear pathway through the tissues. And this avoids damage to things like veins or arteries. And by doing so, you're going to have much less bruising. Also because cannulas tend to be a bit longer, you can actually fill quite a number of areas from just one single entry point, which means less trauma to the skin. You're not jabbing the skin multiple times. And overall, a better and smoother result. At the Victorian Cosmetic Institute, we prefer cannulas over needles because they provide us with a much more smooth and even result. And they also give the patient less bruising, less downtime, and less recovery period.